All right. Again, little old news, but I need to cover it because I need to cover it. You heard me? This ain't Jersey. All right. So Chloe Lacasse. Chloe Lacasse going down the wing. Lacasse. Yeah, man. Chloe Lacasse heads to the NWSL. Can't what? Can't want. Can't WNT star. There you go. Leaves. Oh, Canadian. Is that meant to be Canadian? WNT star leaves Arsenal after just one season to join Utah Royals. Uh, Lakash joins Utah Royals, spent one season with Arsenal, made 28 appearances for the WSL side. What happened? Lakash has left the Gunners after just one season in North London. 31-year-old made 28 appearances, scoring five goals, and she will join the Utah Royals immediately, who sit bottom of the NWSL after 16 matches. What Lakash said in a departing message to the Gunner fans, Lakash said, although my time at Arsenal was short, I was filled with memorable moments. Thanks to the incredible teammates, staff and fans. I'm grateful for the experience and I will always carry with me the memory of scoring in front of you all at the sold out Emirates Stadium. I wish the team and the club. What? I wish the team, the club and all the and all you gooners the very best moving forward. The bigger picture, the reason for Lecas departure after just 12 months are unknown. But reports suggest that the Canadian interna International wanted more minutes on the pitch as well as being... Being closer to her family across the Atlantic, she will be thrown straight into the dogfight as the Royals look to crawl back ground on the NWSL um, rivals above them. Having guided Canada to the quarterfinals at the, at the Summer's Olympic Games, Lacasse will be hoping to hit the ground running at her new club. The Royals are next in action on the August the 24th when they face Bay, Bay FC. So as you can see, this is an old article, but... I was gutted, man. I really like Lacasse. I don't understand. I don't understand the WSL or the women's game in general with their this this one year thing. Twelve months, man, and then they're gone. Did you sign for twelve months? Because it doesn't make any sense to me. There's other reasons behind this. It's not just because you want to go to be closer to your family. That's bollocks, bruv. That's bollocks. That could be in there. I'm not saying it's not in there, but it's come on. You lot are international footballers. You under dig me. Nah, man. Someone needs to explain the, the the women's games. Someone needs to explain the women's game contract. What is this year thing? And then they're just gone. Or they just signed for another WSL team. I don't understand what's going on. You just see them. I even... One player who plays for Barcelona, she's on her way. I think back to WSL. I think I think she's a, um, an England international. Is it bronze? Bronzy? Something like that. She's on her way back because Barcelona are in difficulty. What kind of fuckery is going on? I don't understand. Someone please explain to me the women's games contracts. How is this? How can they be just leaving after a year? Sometimes they leave. They haven't played. Arsenal had a goalkeeper. I even see her. She was in I see her, her training pictures. She got a big coat on catching the ball. And stuff. I, didn't see, I didn't see her once. What was the point in signing? I don't understand it. It's so silly. It's so silly. And we've had... You know how many goalkeepers Arsenal women have had? Jesus Christ, it's embarrassing, man. They just come and go. Come and go. Like, they're like, you know, like if you was to look at the men's team, the third goalkeeper, that's that's the treatment. Just in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. I don't, I'm starting to think why people even become goalkeepers now, obviously. Duh. But as in, in general, like the youth them, it's not like the old days, boy. I just spoke about safe hands. He came from Leeds to Arsenal. Bing, bang, boom. No long thing. I don't see how any goalkeeper is making it now. The last goalkeeper that I rated, shockingly, is going to shock you lot, is the top, is that Tottenham goalkeeper. And he's young. You know what I'm saying? Pickford ain't young anymore. And I didn't used to care for Pickford, but he's shown me that just because he's little don't mean nothing. He can actually get about. You know what I'm saying? And he can do stuff. But... Life, man. I need to know. I need someone to explain to me Wagwan for the women's contracts because I think it's a joke. I think it's an actual joke. I do. So let me know in the comments, people, please, because I actually want to know why are they like six months and then gone? Like, don't they get? Don't they get? The, don't they get like three, four year contracts like 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 the men? No. Someone, please explain to me. I need to know. Or well, I have to Google it, but it probably won't come up. Gonna need that's a need to know basis type shit. So please let me know. 
All right. One more. Well, I'll say one more. Another one before we start digging into more of North London Derby stuff. Here we go. We let another baby go. And this one here cut me deep, man. What's up, people? Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel.